Think computer geeks are the nerds on campus? Well, think again. Because when Fashion Mata Mata headed down to SMU to see how well students were dressing or not, we found to our surprise that the computer geeks are now the ones too cool for school. You're actually a student in information systems. Yeah. So what does that entail? Um, we actually study IT and also um, bits and parts of business management combined together. And you're dressed quite trendy. I thought, you know, like computer programming would be quite geeky, right? That's what a lot of people say. Mm. Yeah. But, but um, I don't believe in that. <laughs> Are you always dressed like that to school? Uh, sometimes depends. What do you mean depends on? If I'm going out after school, then I'll dress up more often. So are you going out after school today? Yes. <laughs> what is the most slack? Like your worst day ever, what did you wear? I wear shorts and uh, maybe a tank top as well as a blazer. Because I find that if you're just dressed, dressed up in a tank top, I think it still looks very sloppy. So having an outer wear would make things better. So tell us what you're wearing from top to top. Um, I'm wearing a toga. It's from Hong Kong. I'm wearing a legging. Mm-hmm. And my oh. shoes are from Korea. Oh, this is like a normal cuff from Korea as well. And this one I bought this from H&M. When you go to school, what do you like to see fellow students dressed in? Jeans and like um, button top and also more accessories. What about for guys? Guys, I think flip-flops are a no-no, a big <laughs> no-no. For girls, um, I think maybe spaghetti stripe, but showing the bra stripes are like a big no-no. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think that's quite a huge turn-off. <laughs> So you're from Harbin. Yeah, the northeast of China, Harbin. For now, it's about minus 30 degree. So how do you usually dress when you're in Harbin? Yeah, very, uh, just too much. You know, <laughs> I like a ball. <laughs> yeah. So I like your shirt. Where's this from? Oh, uh, this just a buy from the orchard. Pants, just a uh, normal pants. And then you're wearing Crocs. Because it's white. White and raining. Yeah. IT 之类的人哈，通常都是那种。书呆子嘛，对不对？我们就是 I S 的 student 嘛，就是很多时候要长期的坐在电脑旁边做 programming， 所以说就是有一些时候呢，我们就是会专注到就是自己的就是 project 上面，所以说就是偶尔会就是不去管理自己的穿穿穿着，但是大部分的时候我觉得还是 OK 的，感觉就是大部分都是 smart casual， 因为我们有很多的 presentation。然后有很多的这种，就是要做一些 interview 这些，所以说你去穿一些 smart casual 的话，就比较方便你每天的日常的学习还有工作这些。有没有看过一些同学可能上学的时候穿得很夸张？嗯，有一些啊，就是还好，女生就是穿得比较好。<笑> Which uni were you in back in in the states?、Uh, University of Minnesota. Okay, so how do Minnesotans usually dress?、Uh, well, it's cold over there, so more coats and jackets and、uh, sweaters.、Um, people here seem to wear a lot more collared shirts. And the girls kind of tend to dress a little more sexy, you think?、Uh, yeah, I guess. Well, also because of the weather, so you can't do that in the Minnesota, otherwise you'll freeze.、So. <laughs> What is the difference in dressing between Singaporean students and students in the U.S.?、Uh, well, Singaporean students seem to have tighter fitting clothes, I guess, than the U.S. That's the main difference, and there's a lot more shorts here than in the U.S. I guess that's more due to the temperature, but、uh, yeah, it's the style is more European versus American. You're saying tighter fitting. Was that in reference to guys or to girls?、Uh, both, I guess, actually.、Uh, like, I mean, guys. Have the tighter fitting shirts and shorts, and same with the girls. That includes the skirts.、So. Good thing, bad thing. Ah,、uh, it depends on who's wearing it, honestly. Ooh, point taken. But the next few girls we spotted on campus not only knew how to play around with tight and loose cuts, balancing out their clothes well. Another thing they were good with, accentuating with a punch of color too. Stay tuned.